Today I'm gonna to talk about how I built a 100 square foot chicken run using nothing but PVC pipe, chicken wire, and zip ties. Didn't use any wood, didn't use any screws. All I needed was 12 10 foot PVC pipes and I put four on the top, four on the bottom, which made a frame in the shape of a square. I also cut 10 foot PVC pipe in half to about five feet and actually used them to reinforce the middle. That way it doesn't collapse on itself. What you also need are eight elbow joints, three-way elbow joints, which actually can connect them. And I put those on the corner as well as seven, I'm sorry, six three-way T-joints, which connect them together. So the 10 foot watt, the 10 foot PVC pipe, I actually cut in the middle so I could attach this. One on the top, one on the bottom. Now, as far as the chicken wire, the one reason why I like zip ties is because you can move them, they're adjustable. You can blend the, you can actually connect the chicken wire together from different areas if you feel like it's getting a little bit too loose in one area you just put a zip tie on and tighten it up but what i like about this over wood is the fact that it's collapsible so it can be moved once you build a wood structure like this it becomes very difficult to move now of course if we go inside i put tarp over here because obviously i live in florida so their shade is definitely something that your birds are going to need because sometimes it can get upwards of 100 degrees. And then I also put tarp on the top of the coop and I'm going to put chicken wire over that. Another thing that you're going to need are going to be sod staples that are around four to six inches and about an inch, an inch and a half across. That way you can put them in to anchor this run in place because since it's PVC, it's pretty light. The one tricky part of this type of design is making a door. Now you could use PVC pipe where I just put an extra five foot PVC pipe right in here. And then I put a screw in the top part or a bolt in the top part and something to stop it. And then right here, I just used uh, what was left in my garage, which was basically just shoe molding. But you can use PVC pipe as well and then actually connect it into a frame of a door. And I'm gonna put chicken wire over this as well. To keep the door shut, I just used adjustable zip ties that actually come off and on. This whole contraption right here costed me about, let's say about $100 for the frame plus whatever I paid for the chicken wire. But with the chicken wire, you're going to have to pay no matter what kind of run you need to do. Zip ties are pretty cheap as well as other things. So if you have any questions, go ahead and drop a comment below, like and subscribe to my page, and check us out for the next video.